Hi guys, welcome back to my instant photography series of video. The Polaroid 630 light mixer dates back in 1984, the most successful period of instant photography. Technically, it is a high-end model in the Polaroid range. It was equipped with an electronically controlled shutter, CD type exposure meter, a built-in flash and automatic shutter speed management. The lens is a plastic one with a single element and a focal length of 109 millimeters. There is a brightness adjustment slider for exposure compensation, fixed focus and automatic flash. Here we have the viewfinder and this is the shutter button. One thing to keep in mind in the Polaroids, also in the latest ones and in these old models, is that when you look through the viewfinder, you're not really seeing what the picture will be. You need always to think about switching a bit on the left after composing there are a lot very very many models of the polaroid 600 version the 630 the 600 there is the light mixer the super color it comes in various colors there is a red version super color version a lot of versions so if you want one vintage polaroid you can search in ebay and you will find this model or some similar models for for 30 to 50 60 euro or dollars and you will get a very very nice polaroid that gets you nice results let me show you some pictures i took in to the beach near my house let's remember that this is a camera that has 36 years on its shoulders and is still capable of taking pictures like this This is my favorite one. So, my takeaway for this video. Even though Polaroid revived their complete lineup of cameras, they are selling new models. Right now there is the Polaroid now, there is the One Step Plus, the One Step 2. I think that if you want to start with film photography, this may be your cheapest option and I guarantee it's not going to be a disappointment because let me show you maybe if you watched the other video about the one step two you already saw it with the one step two you will not get better results Apart from me that I got worse results, but let's say that in the best case I think you will get the same results. So if you're in a if you're a student or if you don't want to spend too much money because you don't know if you will like the instant photography, if you think that the films are already expensive and you don't want to spend too much money on the camera itself. This Polaroid still got it after 36 years. 